When I was trained in implant dentistry, I was trained that implants had to be as long as possible and had to be as wide as possible so that you would have great success. But having a long implant or a wide implant requires more bone grafting, more dependence on bone grafting. What uh, we're learning nowadays with the advancement of the literature is that um, shorter and narrow implants can do work just as fine or sometimes even better than wider or longer implants. Why? Because they depend less on bone augmentation. What we need to restore our implants is basically um, an implant that will have a stable internal connection that will support an abutment and will provide ideal emergence profile for a restoration.